Well, howdy, y'all. Welcome back to Destiny's Princess. I was about to do the introduction. I'm sorry, sis. You want to go right on ahead? <laughs> Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Destiny's Princess. A war story. A love story. Arr, yes, it is. How are you doing? You didn't read the last line. Oh, I'm sorry. A forbidden romance. Arr. Thank you. Anytime. And I'm doing well. I'm Go. glad to hear it. <laughs> all of the voices. All of the all voices. All of the voices. I have not done all of the voices. I know, I know. There's... Because I still haven't talked like this yet. Oh god, I even forgot about him. We haven't seen you him in like You forgot forever. about your fiancé? Well, he's my ex-fiancé, But he, he was still, at one point, your fiancé. Yes, because we saw him, what, at the very beginning of the Masamune chapter, where he told us, Hey, yo, I think we should not do this anymore. Hey, yo, <laughs> he's Razor Ramon? Oh my god, why didn't I make one of them Razor Ramon? I, hey, yo. I, I, I don't know. I don't know. Because I don't know how to do a good Razor Ramon, honestly. <laughs> so Fair enough. I don't even have a toothpick with me. Alright, so I believe we have a story to continue. We do. Ah, uh, yes, your likability is at one-third. And, and we are on the reroute to remain. Not not to be confused with the original route, but we're abandoning that route, and we're making a new one. Yes, All yes, right. clearly. Let's go. You're driving the mouse. Japanese text. From then on, Masamune made an achievement every time he went out on a skirmish. Yar, I did. I swear... I can't compete with Mazamune and his closet full of shirts. <laughs> Yuki Mura let out a sigh. Southern sigh. Please say that again. <laughs> Southern sigh. Thank you. I really like the way you said that. That was funny. Is he really that strong? It's, it's hard. It's hard to say, I mean. From the beginning, he was good at all forms of martial arts, but... He has been fighting blood-curdling demons lately. It's like he's exceeding his limits. He's reached Bankai. He's that strong? The other day, I passed his horse during a fight, and he'd gotten, he'd gotten a mighty bit ticked. The horse or Masamune? Oh, oh, honey, I... All of the above? Uh, you know what? I was going for a different joke there, but I'm going <laughs> to leave it alone. You continue on with the story now. <laughs> he passed my horse, and I was afraid he might mistake me for a demon and shoot me. Look at how smug I am about that. I was excited. Oh. When he usually spoke to me, Masamune was always calm and gentle. Yar. Maybe it's because he wants to make big achievements. He said he needed to make those kinds of achievements to become my husband. He needs to get all of the achieves. No, I no, I don't like achievements. I know. I know. That's why I made the joke. If that was the case, I'd be embarrassed, but happy. But I don't know how serious Masamune is. He's, he's really serial. At any rate, he always aimlessly wandering around. I couldn't see his true feelings. Masamune had gone on an afternoon skirmish. I was busy doing laundry with my handmaid. There's you don't have girl. to do something like this, princess. I'm the handmaid. Oh, okay. The handmaid looked guilty as she spoke. It's okay. The castle is short-handed at the moment. I have to do what I can to help. Plus, this wasn't originally your job, right? You have it really hard. Yes, I'm an accountant. Oh, you poor girl. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I went to grad school for three years. They had grad school back then? Well, I did. Oh, that's impressive. Are you a time traveler? Listen, well, see, what happened was there was this entire incident and... 
Then there was this demon inside of like a sword or a dagger. It might have been a dildo. I don't know. It's, a bit, <laughs> oh it's been a while since we made that joke. So I don't <laughs> know if it's been remembered. But um, you know what? Don't worry about it. It's, it's nothing. <laughs> the handmaiden was ashamed. But, she was, but the princess was ashamed as well. Ever since all this had happened, this was the first time the princess realized she couldn't do anything. At all. Absolutely nothing. <laughs> she was completely worthless because she had the giggles and she can't do anything else. Well, when she'd search for things to help with, well, she tried asking in the kitchen, but man, they kicked her ass right on out. I can cook. Somehow they'd let me help out with sewing and the laundry, but that was it. Because that's all you're good for. Aww. When the vassals were gone, it was hard to live. That was the type of person I'd become. <laughs> wow, way to, way to... Wait, so... Just to take a moment of serious contemplation about this game for a second, because... It's involved with what I do professionally. So this game is meant to appeal to primarily female players. And you're supposed to put yourself in this role. Mm -hmm. But you're supposed to empathize with this useless sack of garbage who isn't <laughs> capable of doing anything herself. Uh, yes. So she's Bella. From Twilight. I, no, thank you, I, I knew. Well, you I, were giving me a bit of a look there, so. My look was, you might have just ruined this for me. <laughs> It hadn't been ruined already? No! Oh. I was rather enjoying it, thank you very much. Well, ignore everything I just said. Alright, I won't watch this video then. <laughs> Princess, do you have archery practice after this? Bitch, no. I mean, yes. <laughs> I have to make sure and hone my skills even while Mu Masamune is away. Masamune had been busy exterminating demons every day. A few days later, Masamune showed up in the courtyard after a long absence. Masamune! Oh, you're still here. I was happy just seeing his face. I ran to him with my bow in hand. <laughs> Dramatic close-up. Arr! Have you been practicing while I've been away, princess? Yeah! Hi! I wouldn't want to shame myself in front of my teacher. He looked me. He looked at me with gentle eye. With his. with his gentle eye. Okay, that made more sense after I read the actual sentence mm. completely. Show me. It's been a while, but let me give you a lesson. So don't show me. I'm gonna give the <laughs> lesson. Listen, I'm really tired. I haven't slept in four days. Okay. I mean, you have been out, you know, on those skirmishes. You know, I wish really he was, like, covered them. in blood or something. <laughs> it just comes back dripping. Yeah. He comes could be back. green blood. I mean, they're demons, right? It doesn't necessarily have to be red. It could be black. could be, yeah, it could be any color. You know, he could just be so, he could just have, like, Roman Reigns, just wet hair. Right. Okay. He had a big smile on his face. That's a small smile. It's a big enough smile. I guess. In Japan. I loved when Masamune smiled like that. <laughs> when I saw that smile, I always felt relieved. A little while after, I had him look at my skills. Arr, you have distributed your skill points completely wrong. Let me readjust the <laughs> character sheet. After that, Masamune petted my head. Good job. I can tell you've trained vigorously. Really? No, I'm just kidding. You're actually completely <laughs> horrible at all this. But I need to reward you for at least trying, so what sounds good to ye? Well then, I handed a bow to Masamune. Whoa. 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 Too early. It's way you too early. You think so? We're in chapter five. Are we in chapter five? Yeah. It's your adventure. It's your adventure. Well... I haven't won the competition yet, right? Like, we said we were gonna, like, I don't remember what in what episode, That's but true. there was a point where, like, we were supposed to have a competition, true. so I think we should have a match. I, yeah, because I think if you ask him to say he has to marry you, he'll remind you about that competition, you know? Probably. I'm gonna, I'm gonna choose to challenge him to a match. Oh, we got the good ding. 
I challenge you to a match. Are you doing the bet you'd mentioned a while ago? Yep. The loser has to listen to whatever the winner says. If I won, I would try asking him to marry me. Hee <laughs> hee. I wanted to see what kind of face he would make. Very well. Masamune had a big smile on his face and nodded. We're going to have a serious match with just one shot each. The loser can't complain, okay? Yar, I. Then I'll start. Yo, good luck, princess. Defeat Masamune, man! Before I knew it, spectators had gathered around us. Jeez, everyone must be have been thirsting for entertainment because they'd been fighting. See, this is why I'm always like Dungeons and Dragons should have been invented a long time ago. Indeed. Also, wouldn't they be tired of seeing people fight considering they've been fighting? Well, you know, it's all they oh, know. Oh, I'm sorry. That sentence didn't finish. Fighting demons nonstop. I took a deep breath and calmed my breathing. I didn't hear a deep breath. Good enough. I carefully aimed at the target. And fired. Oh, I've been hit! <laughs> oh, shit. oh shit! The people around us were in amazement. Others sighed. <sighs> it was a little off. My arrow was slightly left of the bullseye. Yo, don't worry. You did a splendid job, princess. The vassals praised me, You're but Masamune awesome. laughed leisurely. Ha 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 Ye were distracted, weren't ye? Looks like it. I'd wanted to win so badly. My uh, ideal thoughts, idol. my uh, my idle thoughts, had mixed in. You need more practice. Jeez. I sighed and changed places with him. Masamune readied his arrow. Well then, princess, have a good long look. He was composed and confident. Yar. I guess I lost. I sensed it just from seeing him get ready. Well, my opponent was, was Masamune after all. He wouldn't make me do something cruel if he won. Yar, that's what you think. <clears throat> that's a weird noise. Masamune shot his arrow. And? Ah! What? What? I opened my eyes wide, and Masamune was shocked as well. His arrow was extremely far from the target, and had pierced the haystack. Oh! Yo! Yo! I can't believe it! Masamune missed! So do you think he did it on purpose, or do you think it's because Of course he's... I think he did it on purpose, bro! Masamune don't miss! Fair enough! Go! You could ask him. Do you think that would offend him? I don't know. I don't know. I don't really like the I wonder what happened. That feels too passive. I'm gonna ask him. Okay. Masamune, did you go easy on me? Oh. Oh. Masamune answered abrasively. Yara, I wouldn't do something like that. Well, I guess that's true. There was no way Masamune could have missed based on his stance and level of concentration. I hadn't noticed because it shot so fast, but as it flew, the arrow sl slanted diagonally. Yeah, it was as if something had flown at it from an angle and messed it up. Oh! Oh. I was astonished and looked around the courtyard. I then looked up at the roof beside it. Kotaro was sitting on one knee. When our eyes met, he waved his hand at me. Kotaro, did you do this? Kotaro? You mean Fuma Kotaro? When Masamune looked at the roof, Kotaro quickly turned and hid himself. I swear, that Kotaro interrupted us. What was he trying to do? Masamune, take one more shot. That last one was unfair. Uh... Masamune slightly stroked his chin as he spoke. No, I've lost. Why? I won't accept it. 
It's fine, really. On the battlefield, you never know what kind of interruptions might occur. And I have no I have to deal with the circumstances, no matter what happens. If not, then I just lost your We can't redo it. That's what we promised, Yar. <laughs> that may be true, but this isn't a battlefield. We aren't fighting right now. Love is a battlefield. Oh. It's a song. I'd failed in making the proper preparations. That's how a real match is. I should have killed everyone in the vicinity <laughs> before we started. It's my own fault, really. Next time, I'll have to remember. Therefore, it's me loss. But... No buts. It's fine. Masamune petted my head and softened his case to make me listen to him. Well then, princess, what do you want me to do? Um... Oh no, I never thought I'd actually win! Me neither. If I won, I thought of making fun of him by forcing him to ask me to marry him, but... Hmm, perhaps. Well, where's the option there? If I ask, if I win our bet, maybe I'll have him ask me to marry him. It's a memory, so it's not the same. Oh, I see. That's an extreme close-up. Holy crap! Remember, it's memory. Voices can't be the same. Oh, you have to do his uh, voice. Actually, I made a bet. Who the princess will end up marrying? That was way too fast. I'm sorry. Speak up. I'm sorry. Right now, Masamune is a dark horse. If he doesn't win, I'd be in trouble. That's your snake voice, huh? Yes. See, that was better. That was better. Well, there was not a lot of S's in there, okay? Okay. Perhaps Kotaro had heard what I'd mumbled. He had me win the bet to benefit him. I swear, Kotaro... Princess? Masamune looked puzzled. I panicked and waved my hand. No, it's nothing. Nothing, really. Um... Well... I don't know! Well... I don't know. Do you think I should just say marry me? <laughs> Um... I don't think I could say it. Like, I don't think he'll accept. I don't think we're ready. We're only at, like, what? 33%. Yeah. And you did at least one thing that ticked him off? Yeah. I'm not gonna say it. Okay, it's up to you. The pressure's too much. You need to pick. No, I'm not the girl. Alright. I couldn't say it. I was in trouble. What should I do? Originally, I had meant to just tease him... With the way things turned out, I couldn't ask him to marry Why me. Why don't you ask to just be steady? In any case... Yo, princess, this is the perfect opportunity. You have to demand something that's completely beyond reason. <laughs> yeah, man, that sounds good. With the way things were, I couldn't ask him to marry me, even if it was only a joke. Well then, what will you have me do? Um, um, they better have something really good for him to do. That's not just like a complete cop out. Oh, it's all complete cop out. Uh, hmm. Masamune tilted his head. He gazed at me with a smile on his face and. Death. 